We cannot make the biryani without the Hindi spices. The progress uh, made by India in the IT and technology, it's really impressive. We hope that India is going to be successful after hosting, after being president of the current session of the G20. Do we have uh, so many things in common? Uh, for example, the Omani costumes, they make their fashion from the Indian silk. So it is very fam popular in my country and uh, uh, we cannot make the biryani without the Hindi spices. Uh, we have so many things in common and uh, uh, the presence of uh, Indian laborers in my country, we are familiar to each other, we can cooperate in so many fields and uh, the progress uh, made by India in the IT and technology, it's really impressive. I think uh, GC states and my country, they can benefit from such development because the IT technology, the world of IT, it's uh, developing overnight. So that there are many uh, things uh, uh, emerging. And uh, also yesterday we visited the international, uh, the Indian Technology Institute. Uh, we have been uh, uh, seeing the outputs, the graduates of the school and their success stories after they graduated from the institute. It was really impressive and astonishing. Definitely the Indian laborers, they are playing a great role in the economic prosperity, not only in Oman, but also in the GCC states. Uh, we are depending on each other. If I have the potential 60%, maybe India have the potential of 40%, so we can cooperate together and vice versa. That's really important because uh, India with the potentials uh, enjoying in every field can uh, complement the other side of the GC states uh, in many fields. First I would like to extend congratulations to the Indian government for hosting such a big summit and uh, we are really happy because Oman was invi is invited for the uh, summit's meetings. Uh, inviting Oman is also a reflection of the advanced and historic relations, relations between Oman and India and uh, India is hosting the summit amidst uh, very serious challenges. The ongoing conflict in uh, Ukraine and the disruption of supply chains uh, globally and uh, mitigation of climate change. But uh, I'm sure that India can uh, do a good job regarding the issues to be presented in the meetings. And India has gone uh, a long way to uh, mitigate all the issues uh, or the topics presented at the meetings. So we hope that India is going to be successful after hosting, after being president of the current session of the G20.